Hey guys, what's up? Uh, user here, and I'm making a video about NCAA Football 25, or whatever you want to call it at this point, because we don't have a really a confirmed name for this thing. Um, I kind of wanted to break down this this game and talk about the, the the lies, like the real stuff, the fact and fictions, yes and no's, the clear cut black and white things that we know about it, and all the other hypothetical stuff these YouTubers and Twitter people are trying to create to just have content so today's video is brought to you by undisclosed energy drink it is the supplement that helps me stay focused mentally prepared to make these videos to game to go to the gym the problem is they're undisclosed because they don't pay me a damn cent so I'm using a website collegefootball.gg to kind of break down some of the bits and pieces about what this game is and what it isn't and in a very black and white term a lot of this game is just like my friend group talks about this game and all the stuff that's going to happen in it when essentially we just don't know this game is all momentum based off of everybody's memories and good times with it like we don't know anything about the game so let's just dispel some things real quick we're going to do a fact and fiction very quickly and then we're going to talk about some gray stuff so does this game exist yes EA has confirmed, as you can see here, college football is coming back. That means the game is in development. It exists. What would have college football players in it? Yes, but I'll talk more about that in a moment. And it will have college football teams, stadiums. Beyond that, we don't know. That's it. That's the whole fact and fiction part of this video. Okay, so that's the whole thing of this game talking about the player likenesses here we get into the gray areas where people have sources and are just making stuff up from what i understand from the people that i've watched videos on the 24 7 sports was the latest bit of information i saw again i use the information loosely but they stated ea is sending a app to the players basically saying if you want to opt in press this button and upload pictures of yourself for us to render you in the game. Now, that is also being chased by the statement that basically if you opt in for this, you are opting out of your NIL deal. Which is just insane to me to think that you're going to talk someone like Caleb Williams out of opting out of several thousand, if not millions of dollars in NIL money to put his likeness in this game. And... It tells me there's probably going to be some players that are going to opt in for this. I mean, some of them, why wouldn't you? You're just a guy on a buried roster. But if you're one of these big-name five-star recruits that's getting thrown money from all different directions, why would you opt in for that? It doesn't make sense to me. It looks like it's coming out on both consoles. They don't state anything here about the PC, but again... It will not be available on the previous gen. I don't know if that's a confirmation or a statement, but it doesn't sound like it's coming to the PS4 or the old Xbox. So, good luck. Here they're talking about crossplay. They're just describing what crossplay is. It doesn't say a word about if it's actually confirmed or not. Like explicitly confirmed this. So, it, it's just an idea. These are just certain modes, I guess. And I've been seeing this pop up a lot, this this um, ultimate team stuff. So in Madden, you have your Mutt, which is where they make all their money, where they put all their de their design time, the, all the best guy, engineers are working on that 24-7, 365 to make that experience seamless and as good as possible because that's where all the money comes from. They don't give a fuck about franchise mode. They don't give a damn about your online head-to-head -head stuff or the glitches or anything that plagues any of the other modes so i have a rumor i'm going to start um the college mutt is actually going to be called college ultimate national team cunt it's going to be called the cunt mode and you'll have to earn cunt coins with your mom and dad's credit card and all the kids are going to be running to pre-order to get extra cunt features so you, they're going to probably put this likeness stuff from madden into this cunt mode where they'll take players like Tim Tebow, you know, Cam Newton, Justin Jefferson, 
Burrow, some of these guys who already have likenesses from the Madden games and just poured it over to NCAA. Wipe their hands. Great day's work, guys. We already reused assets, thrown it in. Let's go on vacation just like we do for Madden. Um, now let's talk about this release date they're talking about here. Sources. Immediate red flag. Okay. Gator Dave says, EA Sports College Football plan to launch on July 12th, 2024. That's oddly specific, but that's probably when the old games released. I mean, I don't have that information in front of me, but it's a theory. Now, if I was a gambling man and I was saying someone was going to make a college college baseball game, wouldn't it be weird if it launched right around the time college, college baseball would start? Like, I mean, I, how much of a genius would I be guessing that? So... Any of these other modes and features and stuff, I mean, it's all just speculative talk at this point. Dynasty mode will be there. I mean, it's why people bought the game. But let's look at Madden since PS3. They've stripped away dozens of features from that game from the franchise perspective and have been slowly trickling them back in. Not as good as they were, like the mini games, but they're adding them back in slowly. I would assume if they're rebuilding this game or porting it or doing something with it, this dynasty mode will exist, but I wouldn't get my 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 hopes up for it being anything that's going to blow you away. They'll probably have the transfer protocol or something, or they'll patch it in at some point, like way after the fact. But in classic EA fashion, I would assume it's going to be a bare bones. It's just enough to, to even title it dynasty. And they'll patch certain things in after the cunt mode is fully up and running and getting everybody's money. So we'll see about that. But I found this really interesting. So this is EA Sports' website. Um, as you can see, here's some of their games, their launch titles for the past year or two or whatever. NCAA football, uh, it isn't on here anywhere. So that's a little concerning to me. You have your um, coming soon games here. And... Yeah, there's Tales of Kin, whatever that is, and Plants for Zombies 3. Whatever, good for them. No NCAA anywhere. You can't find a drop of information about that game on their own official website. That's, to me, a very bad sign. And part of the reason why I wanted to make this video is because people are hammering on Maximum Football right now for pushing their their initial launch back from, this, from last year to this year. Um cutting down on showing info and stuff to focus on development. There's at least clips on Twitter of that game in action and it improving. There's nothing. I repeat, there is nothing about NCAA anywhere. So if you're watching a YouTube video about that game or listening to someone on Twitter talk about it with their sources, it's just made up hypotheticals at this point we don't know a, a damn thing about any of what's going to be in that game the latest bit of hypothetical we got is they're allegedly making like they were filming a commercial or something like that bravo ea let's clap it up everybody all right ea is possibly maybe making a commercial for ncaa coming up and i guarantee you i can tell you what that trailer will be somebody make sure you clip this and save it it's going to start with like a drum roll. It's going to be the splash of the EA logo. And it's going to be clips of one of the bowl games or something with players coming out of the tunnel. Real players, not in-game engine players. Maybe like a football goes in the air or something like that. You see someone catch it. You get a clip of certain fans. Maybe they're like tailgating for a second. And then you have the NCAA logo flash at the end. It's like 20 seconds of footage. None of it's in-game. It'll say coming soon. That'll be it, okay? So I'm not getting my hopes up, and I'm trying not to dispel the hype for this game, but there's, like, if you look at it at a logical sense, there's really nothing to talk about. So um, I wanted to make this video real quick. I've had a random influx of follower or, like, subscribers lately, so if you're new to, to my channel, I just want to thank you for tuning in for my content, and hopefully this video, it answers some of your questions about the game. I'm out.